so you probably noticed by now, every judge has their own style of judging the household pets. Some judge, uh, I love your tail in my neck. <laughs> Some judges like to ask their names. There's only three, and I guarantee you, I will not remember their names. I, ha I have two <laughs> sons. Their names are Jordan and Justin. My son Jordan's been in the United States Navy for four years. I still call Justin Jordan. <laughs> <laughs> I love her tail right in my face. It's wonderful. Now, what she's doing with her tail, she's uh, distracted. She's got other things that are more interesting than me, but she wants to keep uh, track of where I'm at. <laughs> so that's really what she's doing with her tail is trying to find out exactly where I am. Because she knows that I'm going to put her back, too. She's just that brilliant, aren't you, girl? So I don't ask their names. Um, and I also don't ask the story of how the owner came to own the cat because I've discovered that not all the stories are happy. Some are very tragic and sad that would make me want to hurt people. Finally. Yeah. So uh, I don't ask those stories. As I like, I'm a Libra. We are very peaceable, loving people. Except when it comes to not treating animals the way they should be. Um, so I no longer ask the story. And when it comes to the names, of, with, since there's only three, if I make up their names, I'll remember those, but I won't remember their real names. So, now does everybody, do you all remember your very first cat that you owned when you were a little kid, a little girl? Yeah. Um, my, I came from dog people, we were not allowed to have cats. And, uh, you know, that made us want one even more, of course. Mm -hmm. And the neighbors had a litter of kittens under their porch, because back then, that's what you did. You had them under your porch or in your garage. And uh, we would go over, we, my sister and I, would go over every day and pet those kitties. And then it dawned on us that Mother's Day was coming. So, guess what my mom got for Mother's Day? <laughs> One of those kitties, we tied this beautiful red bow around her neck, and that was my mom's Mother's Day for us. So we got to keep that kitty until we moved, and then um, the best I can tell you is that it, it, she didn't move with us. So I, don't, I don't know the rest of the story. But she was a black and white kitty. And uh, uh, something with that cat awoke something in my heart I didn't know I had that, you know, us as cat lovers all know about. It's this thing about cats. And, uh, you know, we just love them. I love getting, going on Facebook and seeing the, you know, the grumpy kitty. Oh my gosh. Hysterical. And I love the, you know, like, uh, what's his name? Little Bub or something like that. Mm -hmm. There's one called Dolly. I love all those. I just Google them and look <laughs> But, uh, you know, that's who we are because we're inspired by cats. And that first cat of mine inspired me. I was in Israel judging a cat show last weekend. And the weekend before, I was in Moscow. And, you know, if I didn't love cats, I would never even go those places. And I've been to Moscow a bunch of times. I don't need to go back. Israel, it was my first trip. So, um, But it's all because of cats. Because of that first kitty, Perky. Okay, so that's my story. <laughs> have time for everybody else's story but I'd love to hear yours too. Uh, so anyhow in honor of my very first kitty any black and white kitty gets extra points. The perky points that was her name. <laughs> I have not gotten any better at naming cats over the years. <laughs> uh, and so she gets extra points just because she's a black and white. Now my kitty was not this sweet and she really wasn't this pretty but you know she was my kitty and that's all there really and this is our only girl. You're a girl, right? Because you got a pink card. Have you done this before? You are, are you have experience, I know. <laughs> have you been in TV commercials and stuff? She was on TV. You were? The news. Gosh. <laughs> she was on the, the national news. news. And then with like Katie Couric or something? No. No, it was just at a, at a show oh, and they, they yeah. showed her. They showed her. Yeah. On the national news? On the national, it ended up national. It was in, it was at the national capital show. At national capital, yeah, because they had a big meeting. Mm-hmm. Yeah. And she ended up on TV. Oh my gosh, you're famous! <laughs> <laughs> I've been on TV a couple times. <laughs> That's on TV before cats. So, uh, and when they come in with the TV cameras, I'm like, go next door. You know? <laughs> Yes. Oh, I thought you had a question. Any questions? So this is a beautiful black kitty. What I love about her, she's got a couple of white hairs that are intermingled here with her black. And when I look at my eyebrows in the morning, sometimes I see a white one in, intermingled in there too. So, but 
Well, hers are natural. They, they're going to stay there. And her coat is shiny and glossy. And, you know, we have uh, vendors. PK has got uh, excellent cat grooming products. But, you know, he can't sell you anything that's going to get this kind of glossy, shiny coat. It's just from a healthy kitty. She's got a wonderful diet. She probably gets premium cat food and bacon cheeseburgers right now. And had fed hand fed shrimps and lobsters, I'm sure. <laughs> I would have to name you something cute like Cookie. Can I name you Cookie? Okay, and here's Cookie. She's our only girl.